Bubba. Where are we going? There's a way. What? There's a way. And I got a boy ass. There's a race? Uh-huh. Got mommy driving. Yeah. <laughs> per usual. And I'm chilling in my usual spot. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. Saturday. Getting ready to fix me some breakfast. Go check out the, the youth micro quads. The kids are still sleeping, so I'm trying to be quiet. Cruz, uh, he's been up, but uh, he is still sleepy, so he's, he went back to bed. <laughs> All right, my oatmeal's done. Grabbing out the microwave. We have some brown cinnamon, some sugar. Oh yeah. Like I said, we're getting ready to grab some breakfast, go outside, check things out. Try not to freeze. I feel bad for these little mini quads that are getting ready to go out. It's gotta be like 35, maybe. Not ideal, riding weather. <clears throat> but, it is what it is. Make the most of it. We're gonna check out our bike today. We're gonna go break it in. Well, it's broken, but we're gonna go shake it down, ride it around, and uh, go check out the track. Usual Saturday. Only we're riding. Getting ready to walk out the door. <clears throat> Just realized I left my freaking shoes outside last night. Oh, bright. <laughs> Chili. You got a potty. Come on, let's go potty. Let's go potty. Stella's all calm. Oh, Stella's all Decided it's a bit cold. My feet are freezing. Left my shoes outside. We're gonna warm back up for a little bit. We'll try this again in a little bit. Stay tuned. Somebody decided to wake up. It's the morning. Good morning. What are you doing? Did you have a good sleep? Are you gonna go run around with little man some more? Tell me about it. Well. Daddy, um, we we went in the mud because I just wanted to go in the mud. You went in the mud just because you wanted to go in the mud? Yeah, me and Little Man, we went straight in the mud. I went straight in the mud hole. Like, I got stuck right there with my boots. <laughs> They're barely covered in that. Yeah. They're barely covered. Cool. This. Who is that? Ken. Ken. He's all muddy outside. He's all muddy outside. <laughs> I, like, I need to clean that thing he's off. The wrong, he's on the wrong bike. Yeah, no, but this is his very old one. Oh, okay. He used to race this one, but no more. Yep, you're I, right. I just got the wrong bike, but that is one to. Say, Say good morning. Beaver, what are you doing? Shanti! What are you doing? Stop it! Say, so Cruz got his friends over, huh? So they making a mess? Hey! I'm here too. So there's Little Man. Peyton and Cruz. Rock, paper, scissors. This is what my life has become. <laughs> no, no, no. Kids jumping around no, my camper. I no, I didn't hear Rock, wins. paper, scissors. No! We're no, at the races. Peyton. Cool. <laughs> you ready to go? <laughs> what? Go, get your boots on. Don't watch Little Man. <laughs> Don't watch Little Man race, dude. This, which one do you want to put on first? This one? Let that do it. Ow. Oh. Turn the down. Ooh. We can go watch. Little What? Little Man. Little Man. Watch Little Man, watch, watch, let's do it. We do it. We do it. Yeah, what are you doing? Caps and cross those hooks. Little, as we little Man almost missed his, missed his race. Little Man almost always blank. Uh-uh. Huh? No. Why is it blinking? I don't know. Because it don't seem like it wants to go. <laughs> So 
let's hope his bike finishes huh? So it was, it was acting up a little bit, wasn't it? Yeah. All right, they're getting ready to go. What? That was flying. Coming. He should be coming through in a minute. He's. These are these are the kids in the first two rows. I think little man was in the fourth fourth row. Go up there. Chuck, so you guys are late, late this morning. Uh, we woke up on time. How would you like to be in that 8 o'clock race? Shoo. I wouldn't have. What up crew man? Tire racks are sweet. Check that out. Axles ready to go. That's fine. Same transponder. You can try it. That's yeah. what he gave me. He told me this goes on the GNCC bike. Yep. Usually I'm supposed to sign up before I go to tech, but they don't know. He doesn't like scan and show up that I haven't signed up yet, so. <laughs> It'll be alright. But I'll sit my helmet uh, on the couch. That way you have it. Okay. Come on, Bubba. Let's go get some lunch. Daddy's going to go ride. Why? I gotta go look at the track. I gotta go cycle it. That way I know where I'm going. I don't get lost. I don't crash. I don't I don't hit a tree that I don't see. Out here on the track, just checking it out. Doing a little bit of maintenance. We got this cool little split line here. And uh ever since I've been coming here, this outside has always been faster this, but it's always got this water hole right here. Draining the swamp, boys. Cool. Just a pro tip. Use those eyes. Pay attention. Pick up a stick. Don't be scared to do some work. May pay off. It's race day. Crew, wake up. Get up. Get up. Okay. Redo it. <laughs> Don't kill me on the camera. What are you guys doing? Wait now. Huh? Laying down. Laying down. What are you doing? Oh, well, you gnawing on a power cord down there? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's what we need to do, huh? I used to. All right, Daddy's got to fix breakfast. Then go. All right, gonna fix this again. I have my usual. Some brown sugar, cinnamon or maple and brown sugar oatmeal some eggs boiled eggs and we'll go all right gonna eat my oatmeal here and uh Running a little behind, didn't sleep very well. No particular reason, just crew wouldn't go to sleep till midnight, so. <laughs> that was uh, the one he uh, played too hard yesterday. Took a long nap and was like wired until, until literally midnight. But um, yeah, I didn't sleep super good, so kind of slept in a little bit and getting a late start, which is all right, but uh, yeah, the track's looking really good. Nice and tacky, so. But it's really cold as well. That's the only downfall. So we're going to eat our breakfast and bundle up. 
and uh, start the day, get to it. Phew. All right, boys are prepping. Measuring fuel? Yeah. How much you got there? Half a liter. Obviously not. <laughs> <laughs> Got her spick and span. Looking good. That's like on four or five. I never saw. Uh, I have. Really? It was on four. piece comes around back around by the start and man it's packed GNCC is alive and well thriving community here there's a record number of riders and they can barely fit them all in the starting line it's absolutely absurd it's cool to see uh, the weather wasn't looking the best everybody is moaning and whining thinking the place was gonna get canceled like last year but uh, look at this dirt primo bit chilly but hey you know it's winter so like I said tracks looking awesome biggest crowd we've ever had at this event maybe ever most riders ever possibly but uh Morning race is off and rolling. They got a uh, 30 minute late start, so I'm sure that's probably gonna put us like mm, a 130, 145 start. There's a lot of guys, so it's gonna be gnarly. The track's gonna be rough, rutted. Should be sick though. Looking forward to it. Need to go check and see how we get into pro pits real quick before we go inside. All right, getting ready to get ready for the race. Oh, huh, little girl. Oh, you just chilling up here on the bunk. Yeah, you just hanging out, being a good girl. So I got all my gear laid out and I was gonna show you guys what I use. Just making my camel back. How many bottles do you want of this too? Just fill it up. Get full. It's gonna be heavy. Come on, woman. <laughs> So I run a Dekine Camelback. I know I get a lot of questions about this. It's a waist Camelback. Pro tip, make sure you cut and duct tape the edges, the ends when you do it because this will loosen up and fall off you. So you want it to, uh, if you run one of these, duct tape it. That way it doesn't loosen while you ride. I run it. A-Stars, A1 chest protector. Here's my hose. I zip tie this to my chest protector and I cut a slit in the back of my jersey and the front to run the hose through. Got my Mobius, Mobius knee braces. I run these sweet Troy designs. I think they're the, yeah, the 5605. It's got a ass pad in the back and it's padded on the sides and got my TLD gear. A stars, Scott goggles, the GoPro, the gloves, and my Camelback, I run strictly water and this is the product that I'm not allowed to say I use, that I use, and my hand bottles. That stuff, right there. That's my setup, it's pretty simple. Isn't it? <gasps> Isn't it? 
Yeah. Yeah. All right, we're going to get ready. Russell, today's winner, round one, 2020. Caleb, some uh, semi-bold predictions, some might say, on social media here recently, making comments about making people hurt, making people pay. came out today, backed it up, and uh, grabbing a win, number 61. How does it feel to start off with the season for a win, and uh, what were the intentions coming into today? Yeah, there's no way I was gonna lose my last first race ever. So uh, I put the hammer down and uh, got the whole shot, went wire to wire, felt really good. I uh, came in really prepared. I was, um, you know, been dialed in the last seven weeks and just uh, training hard, working hard. And finally, coming the, you know, the season 100% healthy and ready to go. And I feel like I'm back on 2015 form, where uh, you know the race comes to me easy. I, you know, felt re really good at the beginning and uh, really solid. And I, I just kept a pace and uh, that I, I thought would wear those guys down. And um, I just, I just held that pace the, through the whole race, basically. So. I didn't try to like manipulate it, and, you know, hang back and uh, wait for the end. You know, I just went straight from the get-go, just a uh, really solid, solid pace that I knew would be tough to hang on to and uh, was able to pull it in. So about that, you said your last first race. You made the announcement for those watching at home that haven't heard that this will be your last <laughs> full-time season, at least of competition. Does that change your mindset at all for this 2020 season, or is it just business as usual for Caleb Russell? Yeah, it's just business as usual. Um, you know, I'm here to try to win and do the best I can. Just because it's my last last season doesn't mean I'm gonna take it easy. If anything, it's gonna you know fire me up and uh, you know make me work a little harder, which which I feel like I have. So, I'm um, uh, awesome day, uh, awesome weekend. I'm, uh, it's uh, gonna be bittersweet at the end of the year, but uh, it's uh, it's been an awesome career. And uh, like I said, it's my last big buck. And uh, happy to go out on top. This place is awesome. I gotta thank uh, Henry Turner for always letting us come out. We've done a great job at this place. We really like it. Uh, gotta miss it. Hey, All you kids up front, you better get closer. You gotta get sprayed down with some champagne. That shows you were really at a GNCC race, and your parents will love the drive home. Oh, my God. 